Today, we're diving into a classic in the world of trading psychology, Trading in the Zone by Mark Douglas. If you've ever felt like the market was against you or that your emotions were sabotaging your trades, this book is a must read, but don't worry, I'm here to give you the key takeaways. First up, let's talk about the mental game. Douglas argues that successful trading is 80% psychology and only 20% strategy. You might have the best trading system in the world, but if your mindset isn't right, you're likely to fail. The market doesn't care about your feelings and it doesn't owe you anything. You have to detach yourself emotionally and think objectively. Douglas introduces the concept of probabilistic thinking accepting that each trade is independent of the last and that outcomes are uncertain. It's not about being right or wrong on any single trade, but about managing your emotions and maintaining discipline over the long term. Douglas also breaks down common myths that many traders fall victim to. One big myth is that you need to know what's going to happen in the market to make money, but Douglas says that you don't need to predict the market. You just need a solid method and the discipline to stick with it. He also warns against the random rewards myth, where traders get lucky a few times and then start believing they're invincible. This overconfidence can lead to risky trades and eventually big losses. The key is to focus on the process, not the outcome of individual trades. So how do you build the mindset of a winning trader? Douglas suggests creating a trader's mindset which involves cultivating discipline, focus and patience. He emphasises that you must develop confidence in your strategy and be okay with losing trades because losses are a natural part of trading. Douglas also talks about the importance of defining your edge, a specific set of criteria that you use to enter and exit trades. When you have a clear edge, it's easier to make decisions without being influenced by things such as your emotions. And remember, your edge doesn't guarantee success on every trade, but over time, it should give you a positive result. Douglas lays out what he calls the five fundamental truths about trading. And these are, one, anything can happen. Two, you don't need to know what will happen next to make money. Three, there is a random distribution between wins and losses. Four, an edge is simply a higher probability of one thing happening over another. And five, every moment in the market is unique. Understanding these truths helps traders accept the inherent uncertainty in the market and prevents them from making emotional decisions. Finally, Douglas talks about the importance of accepting risk. The fear of losing money can paralyse traders and lead to missed opportunities. The key is to manage risk by never risking more than you're comfortable losing on a single trade. By accepting risk as part of the game, you'll find it easier to make objective decisions and stick to your plan. Douglas emphasises the need for a predefined risk management strategy. He says things like the obvious of using stop loss orders to protect your capital and to avoid emotional decision making in the heat of the moment. To sum it up, Trading in the Zone by Mark Douglas is all about mastering the psychological aspects of trading. It's about building a mindset that can handle the uncertainty and randomness of the market, sticking to your trading plan and managing risk effectively. If you can internalize these lessons, you'll be well on your way to trading success. Thanks for watching. If you found this summary helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. And if you've read Trading in the Zone yourself, drop a comment below and let me know your biggest takeaway. Until next time, keep trading in the zone. This is Amin and this is SMC Wolf FX.